Hi guys. So today I have Ashish Apan with us, who is a very experienced game developer and has been working with Unity 3D, Cocos, and SGL for over three years. So welcome, Ashish. And so tell us more about yourself. So I'm a graduate from Triple IT. I have worked uh, in the field of computer graphics and game development for past three years. So uh, my work includes working on procedural generation, volumetric rendering, and GPU ray tracing. And uh, recently, I've started working on mobile game development as well. Tabred, why why you have planned the Unity game development course? So what are the what is the future you see for this course? So Unity is a very powerful cross-platform uh, game engine. So with Unity, you can create your game once, right in C sharp, and then deploy on different platforms. Also, Unity is a, a high, highly in-demand tech skill, which is growing at a rate of like 35% per year. Plus, it's apart from just game development, Unity is also becoming the go-to tool for uh, AR, VR, and architectural visualizations. So it's not just about game development; it's all about real-time interactive applications. And uh, Unity is the right tool for the job. So there are a lot of online courses uh, which. Teach you Unity and game development. So specifically, asking why one should do this course. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, Unity has a very large community of developers. So like it's obvious that there's a la- large number of courses on Unity online. Uh, the fact and the problem that I've seen myself uh, online is that you can find a lot of tutorials. They will give you uh, the basic overview of working with things. But when you require in-depth knowledge of working with something, that is really hard to find with Unity. So I have experience working with uh, a lot of native platforms. So that experience is transferred into the course as well. So you will learn how things work behind the curtains. So you exactly understand how to optimize and develop your game the way you, the way it should be done. So you talked about in-depth coverage uh, in this course. So I would like to know what all topics uh, or what all games you are going to cover in this course. So uh, it's a hands-on course. So we will start with the course with rapidly prototyping four different kind of games. So firstly, we will start with uh, Jetpack Joyride, uh, kind of a game. So it's a side-scroller infinite runner game. Second game which we will work on, uh, think of a casual game. So it's called Lunar Lander. It's about uh, making a ship land, and uh, it works on basic physics. Thirdly, we will work with a, a match three game. So think like Candy Crush. And fourthly, we will work on a physics-based platformer. So think of a game like Limbo. So the purpose. So each of these games be, uh, belong to a different genre. So you will have a lot of variety in the course, and you will learn different techniques. Uh, and the goal of the course is that you will learn how different system works together. So like working with audio, physics systems, UI systems, and bringing them all together, and then profiling your games. Optimizing them, making sure that they run well on the hardware, will be the main part of the course. And lastly, we will also learn how to uh, add uh, Unity ads into your game, so you can earn revenue from your games as well. Okay, so that's a lot of uh, pretty interesting info. And one thing that what are what all prerequisite knowledge is required to attend this course? So uh, I expect the students just to know uh, basic object-oriented concepts. So experience with any language like Java, Python, C++ would be fine, given that the person has basic knowledge of uh, OOPS concepts. Uh, C sharp or Unity experience is not required. That's great. One last question: What all platforms you are targeting, uh, like Android or desktop or Windows app? So what all yeah, types so of games uh, we will be covering in this okay. course? So mainly we will be targeting uh, uh, Android and desktop game development. So desktop includes Linux PC, uh, Linux, Windows, and Mac. And uh, on mobile, we will mainly focus on Android. And we will also have a look on how we can deploy on web, but mainly Android and desktop. Some great information from you about the course. So I hope you will join Ashish in the Unity game development course. And thanks for watching. See you guys in the course.